All right. I'm going to intro with this, Frankie. Yeah, you should. So about 10 seconds ago, <laughs> I did that. Yeah. Playing with my new little McNeese. It tested very sharp. <laughs> and you've not cut anything with it yet. No, not yet. All right. It's not going to bleed. It doesn't look like it's going to bleed. Very good. I think it was just short of that. All right. Small knives. Frankie, if you have big hands... <laughs> If you have big hands, you're going to cut yourself. With yeah, them. it makes it a lot easier to cut yourself. Easier to cut yourself, yeah. Uh -huh. All right, we got a few of them out today. Yes. Okay, this video, we had to uh, we had to rush to the front. Oh, oh yeah. Um, this video will go live tonight, the same when I'm filming it. Okay. Uh -huh. Frankie, the Reich Knife Hummingbird. Yes. Oh, come <laughs> on. Let me see. Sorry, even my hands are a little like big for it. It is a small knife. This is the Reich Hummingbird, guys. You've seen it probably in other videos um, for I don't know a while now. I want you to say, you might have seen it in prior videos as as which this one, this one, and this one. What do you mean? Like the Simpsons. It just makes me think of the Simpsons. Oh, Troy McClure. Troy McClure. Yes. Yeah. All right. <laughs> I feel like I'm gonna cut myself now. Yeah, probably. Anyway, listen. So these things normally sell. Well, they originally sold for one fifty, mm -hmm. and yeah, I think they're going for one thirty five right now. Is a pretty normal price. You might be able yeah. to get them for less than that. But Frankie Massdrop. Yes, Massdrop lowers the prices for the masses. Yeah. So apparently they're doing an order of um, three different varieties of exclusives, mm -hmm. of which we'll show. But yeah, they're, they're gonna really cool. They're gonna do them for their Massdrop price. Of $80. $80 you can get these. I think that's what I paid for that one. Did you? Yes, I got it from them. I, I forgot, like, yes, where I we got this one. <laughs> yeah. Oh, we did, didn't we? Mm -hmm. Okay, all right. Anyway, if you're still with us, not bleeding. Still not bleeding. Okay. These things are amazing. It's a full-size titanium premium knife, all right, by Reich Knives. Yeah, they make some with amazing Damas stuff. Steel. Yeah, I mean, look at the work on this. Okay. And it's it is so pretty. It is damn steel, amazing detent. If your fingers aren't too big, <laughs> okay. It looks so little in your hands. <laughs> there you go. And actually, it does come with a neck sheath or a yes. sheath for yeah, yeah. You can wear it as neck carry. Okay. Yeah, these things are awesome in a tiny little knife package. Okay, everybody, you gotta have one. Eighty bucks. Yeah. It's a lot to spend on a tiny little knife, but. I don't know. It's kind of worth it. It it's, it just has this really fun like little cool factor. Oh, it definitely, really does. definitely. It's a premium knife well, and remember, scaled way down. Okay, I have to bring this in. Remember what um, uh, Eric from Indiana Knives said that somebody did? He bought one of them for lanyard for his cold steel. Yeah, the Formax, I think it was. Um, somebody out there bought this knife and used it oh as the, the lanyard bead or whatever for a Formax it's giant It's just crazy. Yeah. Anyway. It's, it's probably the smallest one here, isn't it? It is. It really so, is. Here's the Spyderco Ladybug. It's Frankie's custom McNeese. Here's the other McNeese, Spyderco. Yeah. Well, it's about the same size as the McBee. There you go. Where's that Tanto? Can you put it away? No, I brought it over here so I could flip it. Nice flick. I can't flick that one. Yeah. It looks go. huge compared to it. It's a sword. The Reich is still small compared to that. <laughs> but yes, guys. It is a premium titanium folder flipper, okay? Yes, it is. All right, now's the time to get them, though. Um, six days left when we're launching this video, so yeah. you've got to get in on it. It, it is a pre-order. They. It sounds like they'll ship, I think it was March 15th. Yeah, about a month from now. So about a month, all right, from when the drop, when the, the pre-order ends. Well, and I love it. So the colors are really neat looking. The gold. Yeah, let's go over that. Okay, so I'll be showing the pictures, all right? Okay, so gold. that caught my attention first. Mm -hmm. The gold is kind of what we want. Gold. And then like a gold pink. Yeah, the gold pink, and I think it has maybe a blue frame side, fr yes, frame lock side. Yeah. Okay. Well, so it kind of looks rainbowy, sure. and then a green and purple. So it's like this one, but then it's it's like two tone right. version of this. Ooh, I almost threw it. Yeah, it's small, Frankie. You're gonna cut yourself. Yeah. Yeah, but a lot of people already have these out there. They're very popular. Yeah, for a reason. They're kind of. Uh, it's a novelty. It, it really is a novelty, is. and it's just fun. Uh huh. Frankie. Is this a good gift for like a wife it, or girlfriend? 
I think you should get me one. Yeah, she's going to want one. Get me another one. I need to have the gold. In, in gold? Yes, I, was gonna I say, want the gold. Hopefully you want the gold because that's the one I want. I want the gold. Yeah. So, yes, you could tell your wife or girlfriend that you're getting them it for their Valentine's Day present. Actually, here. And um, then they get it a month later. <laughs> a month later, yeah, yeah. Show them the, show them the email yes. um, confirmation. Here, honey, you get this. In a month. And a necklace. You can give them jewelry. Right. Right? <laughs> I don't know. I think it would be an amazing gift. I, th I, I think... Frankie would love it. I think you should get me one. Yeah. I'm just saying. There's the box. I actually saw them at SHOT Show. They had yes. some impressive stuff. Is there a sleeve on top of that? So, they had some impressive stuff. We've looked at, on this channel before, the Reich Thor 4. Thor 4, yeah. Which kind of a... Uh, Oh, it's enlarged. like a big version of this. Yeah, yeah, enlarged version of this. And then I actually owned the 1507T a few years back. Yes. That was a cool knife. In what number? Um, that was production number 001. Yes, yes, I ended up did. selling that uh -huh. one. Eh, after I put a KME edge on it, too. I like the chain that it comes with, too. It's not like a cheap no, chain. No, it's not a flimsy one, is it? I like it. Yeah, this is actually one that you'd feel confident, like, yeah. you know, pulling the knife on. Because it's got super good retention yeah, it does. on that. Almost a little stiff. But. So does the foam. Oh, yeah. You can handle this <laughs> kind of foam. This is fine foam, yes. Yeah, this foam's not bad. No. It's that it's, other, like, it's yeah. firmer. Uh-huh. Yeah. That's what she said. Is it the foam is firmer? We don't know. Don't know. It's firmer. <coughs> you just got to okay. go with those buzzwords. But let's see how much this chunky thing weighs. Oh, yeah. Go for it. Yeah, we have a video on it already. I was yeah. going to give you a size comparison, too. Here, I'll wait really? a second. Go ahead. No. What you got? 0.60. It's not even an ounce. It's a brick. All right, check this out. How much does he weigh? Huh? Oh, just for the hell of it? Nobody cares? <laughs> That's actually lighter than I thought. Yeah. This is the Jake Hoback Quayback gift from Jimmy Slash. Shout out to Jimmy Slash's channel. But look at this. Yeah. You want a size comparison? There you go. You can hang out in his little groove. Yep. That's funny. <laughs> Probably almost fit this knife inside. No. He's thicker than you would think. I don't know. Let's see how thick it is. Now we're just rambling. But you guys should get one. Get one for your wife. We're they would rambling. really thank you. Well, it's mass drop only, okay? You can get Point them. 30. What is it? Point three one. Point three one. It's mass drop only, so you can only get these via mass drop, these varieties, and you're only gonna get that price at mass drop. So yeah. yeah. We're gonna put the links in below where you can get them. Please use those links, it helps us basically get more knives yeah. and if you haven't noticed that's what we're all about so we kind of have an addiction yeah a little bit but i don't know tiny knives this is a good one it you, you is. don't even have to collect the tiny knives but you got to have this one well and this was the first damn steel that we actually ever had which yeah. is funny was it so, yeah uh -huh, it was that we owned yes. yeah so you can start your damn steel collection was it Damascus Steel who did the band aids in 2016? Yeah, it was. Damascus Steel had. Um, Do we have one? I don't. Yeah. Not not around, but yeah, Damascus Steel had their band aids that they were giving out. I swear, I just used one. Blade Show 2016. I thought that was super cool. I could almost use one for this video. No, it was just shy of bleeding there. You're right. I can't find it. No, I don't even I'm know back. why you tried. I tried. All right. You need to organize this room. No, it's it's not the detent that's wrong with this. It's it's just the size of the <laughs> flipper tab, which is appropriately sized. Yeah, it is for the knife. Okay. He really likes the um, light, light switch. switch. Yeah. Let me see. I don't know what the hell I'm doing. Yeah, it likes a light switch. Yeah, it does. Yeah. Okay. And damn, it's still on that. Yeah, uh -huh. it's a premium knife, just in a small little package. Yeah. All right. Um, definitely want to see your feedback from those who already have them. Yeah. Because I know you'll love them. It is really little. Because I I know people, when you get it, you're still kind of like, um, it's way smaller than I thought it was going to be. Yeah. It really is. Everybody pretty much says that. It's way smaller than they expected it to be. Right. Well, if you have a McBee, look, at, also look at how much they... smaller this is. Yeah, yeah. It's true. It's a really small knife. So just know that getting into it. But that's just the cool factor yeah, of it. Yeah, it is. It's just the cool factor of it. I should put an edge on this knife. Yeah, you should. Look at that. Just mm -hmm. like a super fat edge a on there. A fatty? Mm hmm It would be an easy job. A fatty hummingbird. <laughs> yeah. That would be an easy job. Yeah. All right. Listen for it. Awesome detent. <laughs> well, and right. it has a little spot for a lanyard, too. 
So, yeah, I mean, which might be a good way to carry it too. Yeah, it would be. Does the clip come off easily? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I don't know. I wouldn't. I wouldn't touch it. I wouldn't do anything to yeah. that one. Yeah. All right, guys. Links down below. You got six days left from when this video posts, but depending on when you're seeing it, they may be gone. Okay. Um, definitely get in on it and yeah. Are you getting me a gold? I think we'll probably have to get one. Give me goldie. All right. Thanks a lot for joining us and thanks a lot for using our links to uh, purchase because uh -huh. we need more knives. Yeah. Clearly, we need more knives. Yeah, we have a problem. This is uh, this support is us scarce. In, support us in our problem. Our addiction. All right. Thanks a lot for joining us.